Happy Sunday, everyone. I'm Colleen with Awaken Catholic, and this is Awaken the Saint. Today, we're talking about a Bavarian saint from the 13th century, Saint Hedwig of Silesia. And no, we're not talking about Harry Potter's owl. She is actually also sometimes referred to as Saint Hedwig of Andex. Born in the Andex, Bavaria, to the Duke of Croatia and Dalmatia sometime between 1174 and 1178, she grew up heavily influenced by her royal family's Catholic faith. In fact, you may recognize her niece, who is also canonized, St. Elizabeth of Hungary. Hedwig received an excellent education and could read, write, and interpret scriptures. When she was 12 years old, she married Henry the Bearded, future Duke of Silesia in Poland, and had seven children, four sons and three daughters. Theirs was a happy marriage, and both lived out very pious lives. Hedwig was known for her generosity, providing aid to widows and orphans, in addition to founding several hospitals for the sick. Although she had the riches afforded to nobility, she donated her fortunes to the church and lived by very humble means. Legend has it that she went barefoot, even in winter, and when she was urged by the bishop to wear shoes, she carried them in her hands. After she had her last child in 1209, Hedwig and Henry decided to take a vow of chastity together and kept that vow until Henry's death in 1238. Upon his death, St. Hedwig moved into a Cistercian monastery for nuns, led by her daughter Gertrude. She wore the religious habit of a lay sister, but she never took vows. Hedwig was no stranger to heartbreak during her lifetime. In addition to losing her husband, she lost several children in childhood and watched as her only adult son was murdered on a battlefield. These tragedies would be enough to destroy some people and break their relationship with God, but not Hedwig. Carrying these moments in her heart, she continued to live out the faith she was raised with and kept her focus on the needs of others under her care. She allowed no one to leave her sight without being comforted first. Another legend tells us she once spent 10 weeks teaching a poor woman the Our Father. When she died on October 16, 1243, she was reunited and buried next to her husband at Trzebnica Abbey. She was canonized in 1267 by Pope Clement IV. St. Hedwig of Silesia's humility, generous spirit, and faithfulness left an inspiring witness for us all. She truly understood that the purpose of her life was not to gain and store riches, but rather to give all she had away freely and love people as God loved her. The model of her life leaves us with this question to ask ourselves. What's keeping us from giving ourselves away freely for love of God? St. Hedwig of Silesia, pray for us. Thank you for tuning in to Awaken the Saint. Awaken the Saint is a three-minute daily show that unpacks the lives of the saints with practical messages for everyday life. Awaken the Saint is made in partnership by Spoke Street Media and Awaken Catholic.